What's going on, everybody? I'm back. Today, we're gonna start playing Red Dead Redemption. Great game. I always heard it had a great story, great characters. I played like the first mission or so months ago. Gotta be now at, that, at this point. <clears throat> but I'm gonna start fresh, start over. F from what I heard, I think it's like a 40 hour campaign or story mode. So I'll probably be doing two hours a day streaming this for the next month or so. Maybe occasionally I'll, swap, I'll switch it out, get something fresh in. But we will finish this game. We'll enjoy it. Just want to give the warning now. I'm not the best uh, at shooting. Not really that good. But I'm going to try. Wait, are there any... I just had to take that part because I don't know if this slur is said in this game considering the time period. I don't think so. I don't think so, but there might be. So I don't want to take that chance. Alright. What's going on, everybody? Hope you're having a good day. You guys had a great night last night. Yeah. All right, so let me see if I can restart. New game. Yes. I just got to do a new game. Like I said, I've played first mission or so. I want to start from the fresh, from the beginning. I've seen a lot about this game. I, I know how it ends. I think it's at a point in time. This game's, what, five years now? I think this came out in 2018. It's been about five years now, so I know how the game ends. But, oh, man, do I remember the time when this game came out? I remember I watched Markiplier play this. I, I watched, I think I watched the first video on it. I, I never really continued because I wanted to play it myself one day, but I never got around to it. But now I have no excuse to not play it now. Stream it, play it, enjoy it. By 1899, the ages of outlaws and gunslingers was at its end. But if I remember, I know Red Dead Redemption, the first one comes takes place after this. So I guess that's the end of the time. America has become a lamb of law. <laughs> the end of law don't matter much. <clears throat> Even the West had mostly been tamed. Few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. I think that'd be a fun game. Western town, but you're the sheriff. You gotta hunt down criminal gangs. Like, what gang could I? Like with Match Payne, how how you had to take down? I guess with a lot of games like Call of Duty, how you have to take down the big bad mafia. 
a mafia type game but taking place in the West as a sheriff. I think that'd be a good game. When I might play mafia. If that's something you guys want to see, let me know. I'd have no problem playing that. I love that game. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh, if we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Oh. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place That's where we us. can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know... An old man in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! It's crazy that this is how people people actually used to live back in that time. Horses, carriages, winter being dastardly. Hmm. What a time back then. Chapter 1, Coulter. Phil Hooker. I hardly knew her. Bring him in here. Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Hmm. Well, I don't know why they do that. Stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this, just for a short bit, and I don't see what other choice we have. Listen, listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, they Jesus may be okay. Christ. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Oh, so now, crazy. <laughs> if I could throw myself in the ground in their stead, I'd do it. Gladly. But we are gonna ride out and we are gonna find some food. Everybody. We're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, Get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Aye, aye, Captain. Come on, Arthur. Lazlo. Right. Oh, I remember him from GTA. Got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So, they both must have headed down. Well, yes, of course you didn't run into them. You just hey. left the door. I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. 
I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. Okay. All right. Let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This guy, we got this. Been two days or this more is like a like normal Detroit town. night. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Like February. Careful over this bridge here. Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Fuck the how he see it anything? I can't see shit. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I tell you what. The horses being in replacements of cars definitely will set this game out different. I think it's a part I enjoy about this game. Don't get me wrong, I always love speeding through the streets of the downtown city. But something different. Kinda of peaceful. I could only imagine how cold it is. You sure about this, Micah? Mr. Morgan. I never thought Hold on everybody. I Keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Hey. Okay. Let's head down there. I like the trails of the horses in the snow. Belt is displayed at the lower left corner. Gotcha. Let's hitch up here. <sighs> he 
Hitch up our horse. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Someone's having fun oh. in there. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that way. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of them. All right, staying low. All right, let's see what's going on. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Excuse Anyone me? there? Hello? Oh, oh uh, got a high. Hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> Look, there's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur, need some. There's a body in the corpse. Oh, I hear you. Just Gentlemen. keep your eyes. Shit! Look out! There's more to pay! Boy. Oh, that's a motherfucker. I thought that was like Micah or something. Didn't seem to be going too well. Look, man. Closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Hey, I will take some salted meat, don't get me wrong. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Examine thy foot hope. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married too. What does that say? Jake and Sadie wedding, September 7th, 1897. Damn, to think I'd be born 11 days and like, uh, fuck it, 109 years later. O'Driscoll's, I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Last oat cakes. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's. Yeah. Nearly as big as the one on yours. One calm dead is about the only thing me and fruit. Take some of that. Can't uh, peach it. Starving. You should eat something now. Get your okay. Thanks up for the ride back. Set your cabinet. Canned vegetables, or canned vegetables. Oh, even more. Place is dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Uh, guys, I will be right back. I have to take care of something. <laughs>
I apologize for that, everyone, but I am back. Alright. Let's continue. Where were we? Okay, looting. Keep searching while I pack Anything else? On the horses. No. Man. Meet me out here when you're done. Alright. Ooh, opened health cure. Let's see what that got. Alright, three open health cures. Got it. Alright, what you got up here for us? Bed. Revolver rounds. Okay. Oat cakes. I think that's it. Alright, I think that's everything in the cabin. Or they should be. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Alright, let's go Micah, see. Micah, you search the cabin. See what we missed. Sure. What the fuck? Yeah, and I'm gonna fuck you up too. What's going on? Now this guy just jumped me. Oh, did he now? Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? Yes. No. Come on. Find out what they're doing here and where Calm is. Oh, this son of a bitch would talk. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? Uh, with the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Wait, I thought we went to Near the camp. lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Well, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. Now, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> Well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. Oh, he's dead as hell. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. Now, where's my hat? Do I not have a hat? Teach this motherfucker a damn lesson. It's okay. Take it easy there. Uh, see, it's a nice horsey. Yeah, okay, boy. Come on, follow me. Damn, Micah! Oh. Fucking idiot! Are you okay, Miss? They came three days ago, and my husband. They... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. 
Kent, you can't stay here. You come with us. Of course. Yes. It's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Sadie Mrs. Adler. I... Oh. He... Yeah, she ain't misses anymore. He was my husband. You're miss. Damn. Shit's crazy. Hey! Somebody's coming! Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back! How'd you get on? Uh, Mike have found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Combe O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh. We found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. Cheryl, three, three days? That's weak. Mr. I haven't Shale, slept in the last boy. four years. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Right. I've you, been Mr. using Mr. my tears as Mr. Fuel. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Whoa, okay, calm down there, Micah. Micah. Whoa. You know what? He could have said a lot worse, I think. I know he could have said a lot worse. Yes, overwrite. Ah. <sighs> Ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me hey he's fair you got a point thank you this way last I know John was headed up the river for all we know he kept riding north and never looked back he wouldn't leave I like that uh, wouldn't be the first time Hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Not them O'Driscoll well, boys. So it's good old Johnny left. boy. 
recently. And I'll be right back, that sir. Way. Oh, well, come on then. Here's some tracks leading to the river. For sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way, but it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. They continue along the cliff wall here. Davy got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. I don't even see tracks anymore. Unless I'm missing something. Yeah, I don't know what tracks we're following because I don't see any. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there. Hey, look! Over there! You see that? John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Oh, that's... Let's see if he can hear us. I can't carry both. I ain't got range, but I promise you, whoever is close up on me, he gonna be feeling it. You sure about this? It's coming from this way. Okay. It's slippery. Be careful. Trust me. I've learned. Me. Played enough GTA to be on a mountain, just to the point where it's steep enough where you slip. I know most people think of Mount Chiliad. There's a drop here. Watch out here. Stay low under here. Oh shit. 
not mean to do that. Okay, hey. good now. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up here. Come on. Come on. Sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. You're telling me why the fuck would John do all of this? Why ain't he just cut open the horse and fucking land its corpse? Like what they did in uh, Star Wars or some shit. How you doing? I'm miserable. Then it's a few days. I know. Here. Take a drink of that. Thanks. I'm not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, can you hear me? John, you there? Marston, you hear me? That's John! We're coming! Over here! Oh, this way. Okay. Down here! Alright! Hot down, Marston! <laughs> He's down here. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but... Good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <clears throat> Freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. <clears throat> Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I think so. Come on. <laughs> Hopefully this will lead us out. Wolves? Oh no! See, I wish I had my revolver on. That should, at least I got some sort of range. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. Okay. Here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Okay. Yeah. What's good, bitch? Okay, okay. Okay, bro. I just chill. Calm down, man. Good work, Arthur. Man, loot him. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. Amy. I've been bit by a dog once. I deserved it because I was being a little dickhead, but still, oh, shit hurt. 
shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. <laughs> Should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. Yeah, I 90% confident if a group of wolves came to ramp to the camp, so it would be done for. It. It'd be food, pelts, all that shit. With me alone, I just killed like, what, nine? Eight of them? Nine? Eight, nine of them? Imagine what a full camp of people could do. That's where we camped. Nearly there. Can we get some help here? Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive! You're alive! Right, here we go. There we go. <gasps> Ay, careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, I think. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I uh, suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Yeah. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Let's you, get Morgan. warm. <sighs> Damn. Combat on the horse. I have to get used to that. We have been running for weeks. For weeks. We found shelter and been shelter. resting here in some old abandoned mining Rest. town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Spring. I got anything. So what now, Dutch? We get strong, we get warm, and we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. <laughs> and we're safe okay. here. Warm Such. enough. Such. I guess. We sound doubtful. More classic bookcase. Doubtful, just worried. Alright, I will go for the exit section again. Feel that this is honestly anything. Oh. Oh. I hope not. Hey, well, let me go talk to. But then Bill, the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money. Yeah, I'll go talk. I'll do Bill's mission first. Oh, that's Javier. Never mind. Bill no, is boys because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lam. And you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess... I guess folks miss them. That fell? But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> a party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! God, I fucking you hate Michael already. punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. 
Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Cole Yeah, Tristan. bushwhacked. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about Take more than that. revenge for business long ago. Did hey, anybody else see that strap? About trains and detonators, detonators. here. Cole always had oh. good information. Come on. I'm going to do something illegal with this rope. Right I promise you that. Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah. Well, he had to say that with so much drama, like snazziness. I, I don't know what the word. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score they're planning. That tracks, horses, quite a few of them. I'm hoping by the time I finish this well, game, I can tell, if it is true, exactly if they're gonna put the Call of Duties on the Game Pass, they must be this I'll way. be able to go back to play some of the older Call of Duty campaigns. You good? Because I have some, but I don't have enough to like just play them Listen, straight. I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but I'd rather just play from the, the beginning right all the way up to like current. Okay. Minus Vanguard, I don't have Vanguard, you know I got your and back. I doubt they put, they're gonna put Vanguard on I the game pass. A long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him and people you love. And I doubt I'll play the new Call of Duty campaign at least yet. I will probably wait for that game to go on sale. Because I don't really particularly enjoy Call of Duties anymore. The new ones are just... I get it, games have to change. And eventually all games will be changing. I just don't like the change they want. I know it's not just me that feels that. That's just how it is. So, one day I'll play the Call of Duty campaign. Don't. Probably not gonna be when the Call of Duty comes out. Maybe, just maybe around Christmas, because I bought the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 for Christmas last year. This year, I guess technically, or whatever. But All just right, maybe. Gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I. We're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position. I like how he said, I like how it goes by last name, keep it formal. Let's go. We go up here, right? I think. Right, let's see. All right. Horses, there people, buildings. That's Got it. Definitely Got it. Him. Home? I think so. so. Yeah, that's him. All right. Let's see. Are we just gonna sit here and watch him, or can we just we're, just... we're watching him get on a horse to leave. If he's the one we want dead, why don't we just start attacking now before he gets to run? But... 
Who's he that just makes too to? much sense. He don't seem very happy. Well, fuck his happiness. No. Damn. Me personally, I Will am not being bitch slapped like that. Should we go get him? No. He ain't been nothing but disrespectful just so. But if that's how that boy be running, out of there. that's on him. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down there. Uh. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your yep, horse. Yep, the rifle, I know. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. You got it, Dutch. I'm gonna stick to Alder. Good. Come on, let's go. All right. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our a little needs bit. right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Mm. Everything else, including calm, can wait. Creech. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal Not really with it as Now, come on. Ah, uh, come on, man. Can I just start picking off people from up here? I got a rifle. You see, I could clearly end that guy. Plain as day, shot to the back of the head. That motherfucker wouldn't even have seen it coming. But no. I have to fucking walk at snail speed. It's steep here. Careful. Why be careful? Where's the fun in that? Run full speed. Straight down the cliff. Hit him with that Leroy Jenkins. Run in, start blasting, catch the motherfuckers off guard. Yep. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there first. Oh my god, can we go any slower? Let's head for that building in front. Yeah, has anybody seen Liam? Or is Liam the guy brutally murdered in that barn? Probably the guy brutally murdered. Nah, I figured they would have seen hey, known by now. Come on, follow me. Okay, let's get in cover. Ready for this job to be done. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the What the hell are you How the fuck do right, I shot the guy's hat off. Fuck you. Sons of Again! Another fucking hat shot off. Let's go. Right, that was Hey, cover. Damn. Lucky boy. Where the fuck are they shooting at? Alright, that one, that's just. Where the fuck is uh, somebody shooting at?
got some in those cabins. What a beautiful day. But a beautiful day indeed. Open snake oil. Of course not. Paul doesn't give a damn, damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun and ride a horse and kill without thought, you're in. Think how long some of you have been with me. I imagine Paul doesn't even know half the names of these fools. Alright, make sure my guns are reloaded. Alright, where the fuck are you dickheads shooting from? The trees? Oh no, Charlie's! Damn, I blasted those two motherfuckers, I'll tell you what. Hold ground. Advance. Fuck you. Bastards. Come on, man. Everyone with me. Let's get into that forest and clear them out. Snake tonic. Back to the camp. We'll get what we need. Clear out. Alright, I'll continue looting these bodies. If I can loot them, I'm taking. Ain't no reason to pass up on perfectly good loot. Damn, that boy's fucked up. <laughs> that did I not do that? Item Dead Eye Tonic. Hey, I guess I had to pop it again. A little stupid. I thought the micro for a second. About to be a happy motherfucker. Or snake oil. Ooh, that one was unopened. Keep looting. Horse medicine. Did I skip over a body? I did back there. Oh, that body. I didn't even see that shit. <sighs> Just getting rounds, and cigarettes, and all that type of shit. Get me wrong, I mean, loot is loot, but Jesus. Give me something I could actually use. Weapon needs cleaning. Okay, I'll figure that out. Eventually. I think I skipped one of those bodies back there. Like the X looks a lot darker than it should be. Oh well, yeah, I did definitely either skip one or two bodies back there. It is what it is. Are they just literally copy and paste of the same enemies? We don't have time to mess around. Who's messing around? I ain't. Good work, boys. I've been now, on a killing spree. Let's tear this place apart. <clears throat> Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike. Search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. 
All right, man, quick! Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Crackers. As in the food, Twitch. I don't know what their policy on that word is. What have we got here? All right, let's see. Huh, I wonder if they keep the dynamite, dynamite in a box called dynamite. Hey, well, goddamn. This looks good. I'm a fucking detective. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. Come on. Man, if it wasn't for my big brain, I Did wonder how they would have found it. Think so, boss? Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Who keeps that on them naturally? Oh, yeah. Interesting. Had to this catch is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back what up. type of name Let's is that? Moving. Leviticus Cornwall. Sounds like a real fucking All cornball. Right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. I did most of the work. Down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down uh, They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back. I'll let everybody fight. else take the That's credit. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us. And I believe, I know, they will all be back. I well, doubt he it. Didn't get cold, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> Yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Our horses are in sync. They were in sync. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Colm? Leave him to me. God damn it! What the fuck? Where's my horse? Is it dead? I think. Okay, no, my horse is alive. Get on, motherfucker! Get, get, escape! Okay, you got it. Ah! God damn these fucking rocks! Yeah. Come on, horse. Faster. Make up for my mistake. Oof. Yeah. Oh, this motherfucker gonna regret not going faster. Go, go. What if I just shoot his horse? Can I just shoot out his horse? Stay back. Yeet. Oh, no, yeah, know. got his ass. What happened, man? What happened? I'm gonna fucking tie your ass up and your mammy can't save you. Shit. No, you know. Shit. First off, give me all your good things. Come on, I, I, I'm nobody, mister. Hey, you got a ring, so you something. Aw, you lost your hat, man. That sucks. Get okay. it on. Comfortable enough for you? Just let me go. Come on. No. Why would What's I ever let you go? Boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. 
This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! That's what they all say. Go to jail. Please, mister. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. That'll do. Stamina regen. Have a heart, mister. Oh, I think I'm gonna puke. I don't wanna die, mister. Are you uh, trying to test me? Is my that it? Gosh, shut the fuck up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. <laughs> Jeez, how far? upgrade this bitch. Put a couple more horsepowers on her. Look what I got, everybody. Call myself a Duffy. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Don't hurt me, please. No, oh, don't worry. That ain't They're up to me, man. Nice. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. Yeah, maggot. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas. Is need shooting? Save fellas? Is need saving and feed him. Is need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it. An O'Driscoll in my camp. No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, Mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Look, I ain't gonna lie. Well I done, doubt man. he likes O'Driscoll with the way O'Driscoll just fucking slap the fuck out of him. Time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. <laughs> Okay. This is my hair. Let's see what uh, Pearson needs, or whatever his name is. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. 
We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When Make that 13 Navy, now. I, I do not wish to hear about Man, what they you had got the Navy back the Navy, then? Mr. Pearson. We were oh, of course you did. Am I fucking stupid? For 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I saw Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. That's fucked up, Lenny's man. more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Damn, Charles a man. <coughs> Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on, this way. Got 22 arrows, sorted, salted, yeah. awful. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. I can't imagine. I mean. <sighs> so, in his, pers his perspective, I doubt it's to gonna be that hard. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. Yeah, but I don't think you really find much in the wintertime. Because that's why like, people always stock up food in the summer and fall. Survive the winter. Oh, well, I guess it is spring, you know, they said. It's like May or something. I wish I could just have a lot of more. snow, so I guess they're not I hibernating. Like that. Just allowed to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that. I don't think I'd ever go hunting though. Well, I have no problem there, eating at that animal, but I I don't sure think I'd be able to good. kill an animal myself. I get sad when I see those ASPCA commercials, so I doubt I'd be able to kill a deer or something. Especially when they show the cats, oh man. Cause I'm a cat person. I like dogs, but I just prefer cats more. I've had more cats throughout my life. I've had a few dogs. I had a German Shepherd. F two German Shepherds actually growing up. I always had more cats. Easier to take care of, and me personally, I just have more fun playing with cats. See some of the ground uncovered here. Let's look huh. down this way. Whoa. Hmm. The winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh. Stay quiet. Hey, right, fine, man. Jeez. Stop here a second. I see something. Uh, careful. <sighs> Has deer been here? And recently. How can you tell? How can you not? My Let's Lord. walk it from here. I see mushrooms with bigger brains. You're gonna need the bow. Grabbing the bow. 
gun will scare everything up. Oh. Wait a minute. Why is this again? Stay low and move slowly. Stay frosty. You see the tracks? I uh, nope. think so. Maybe not. Focus. Ah, I see. Once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track Neely as well and grab. single thing do they suspect. Oh! Right there! What a majestic creature! Wait, look! Known to the man. There they are. Quick! Get that bow out, Arthur! Aim for their head or neck. Uh, wow, I am actually fucking amazed if I was it, that I was able to do that. I didn't know that fucking pulling on the bowstring. I should assume pulling on the bowstring would have caused, uh, would have, could assume, would have consumed stamina. I guess, uh, what you call it? He'll get it. Yeah, fucking. Should I even crouch, man? And tell me to be crouched. God damn you. <gasps> oh my gosh. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can do. I tried. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. There it is. Now my horse is coming. I'm gonna get this pack on my horse. Alright. Stow is a deer. Not bad, boy. A doe. That's, I'm pretty sure that's a doe, not an actual deer. I don't know. I just be saying shit sometimes. Yeah. Ready to head back when you are. Come on then, let's head back. Nice work, Arthur. That should be enough meat here to keep us all Take my hand off the controller days. for a singular second. You found him! I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. <laughs> yeah. 
You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big game. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Comb, and Is that a fucking bear? And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. Am I seeing Watch shit? Up. Bear up ahead. Oh. Let's see if we can find another way around. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Come on, man. I want to try. You must be hungry. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. I just go bop, bop, bop. Yeah. Cut up here, off the trail. Good job. Talk that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I'm just... I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh yes, Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. Damn, 20 years? Yeah. Taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. 
Won't take nobody but him. Oh, fuck that hurt. Ah. What is that glitching thing happening at the top of my screen? Anybody else? Is that popping up on a stream? It is. I guess it's something. I'm gonna hit the game over here. Brought some food back, boys! Alright, let's see. White tailed deer. Get these over to Pearson. Right, uh, thank you right, for it. showing me how to use the bow properly. I only right. showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well. <clears throat> Jesus. Just drop it down in here. What a surprise. I find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. He loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, <laughs> it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> <laughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? <coughs> Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, you, you dumped on the floor there. God. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You uh, know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, uh, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck. Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting, after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> few days later. Been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. Want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He see me now. What's left of me? What about oh, you? Oh shit! Guess I was hoping Subway is now owned by the same people that Glad own Arby's. You'll see plenty of them. That's You're a crazy. Man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. All right, let's Why see what some news going this, things going on. Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Trump has hired the same oh, lawyers as Gunner. I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... 
I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Maybe I'll now, make that a thing. Suddenly we're about to rob a At train. the beginning of every stream, what before choice? I start playing, I'll go through and read the Leviticus news for the day. Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? Yeah, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Yeah, we're robbing a train. We're crazy. Everyone ready? All right, let's head out. Okay, gentlemen, listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. The Grizzlies? There's a raised spot there. Oh, we gotta watch out for Jaw then, because that motherfucker is a shooter. You'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. Mr. You and Cornwall's me, Morgan's private car. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Yes. Yes, boss. Good. Now come on. Let's ride. We're on an adventure. up here after us something tells I'll me I'm gonna we're gonna have boys. to deal with the Driscolls See? this is what I call a crew Micah Bell Charles Smith Arthur Morgan Javier watch it oh maybe it's a motherfucker Micah riding Bell, up on me Charles Smith ah uh. Morgan Javier Escuela and what about young Lenny here always the first man on his horse just happy we're back at him, Dutch. Woo! Micah, get the ready? fuck out of my face! Can't see shit! Almost, I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times are you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back. And that's the end of it. The money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. There's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. This bus. Yep. There, boy. How you getting on? Yeah. yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Yeah. Of course. Can I help a little? 
All right. I'll go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Can't be that hard. Blowing some wire. Getting this done with. Alright, let's. So you cut the rope, the wire. Okay, this is good. Alright, that should do it. You head back up to the others, I got it from here. Let's go, boy. About time. I have to say, I'm rather looking forward to this. Just be ready to move quick and remember the plan. All of you, no mistakes. Got it, Dutch. On? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Oh. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here. Revolver, shotgun, revolver, sh shotgun. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna take the shotgun this time. Oh shit, that's cool. I don't know you put the mask on. Gentlemen, it's time. Wow, that's loud. Polly, you all know what to do. Ha, boomy! Here we go. Shit, no! What? God! Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. So it's my Come fault. on! You're pathetic. You know that? Hey, we robbing a train no matter what. Good. 
it. Where the hell are the others? so much. Candy. Cigars. Come on. I'm coming, I'm coming. You two all right? Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Yes. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. The fuck we was that? We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We are opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Well, okay. Oh. Wake them up a little! You got no way in here! That's enough! Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, Hope this fucking shit works now. But you boys in there oh, I do it from this side. Okay. Want to take a step back. Hold on, everyone. I'll be right back.
I am back, everybody. Sorry, I had to take that call. Seems good enough. All right, so like light world? fuse. I hope these motherfuckers prepare, cause your shit about to go live. You got a death wish. I'd step back, fellers. Fellers. Why you say fellers with a hard R? Come. Hey, let's go. <laughs> Jesus, why am I why am I caught on an invisible wall? Okay, I gotta press Y instead of just climbing. Look at this place. It's, it's like a black like house. Oh, I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. I you don't know. Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's king. I'll give you that. Okay. Platinum pocket Let's see watch. See if we can get this open. Come on. Come on. I don't want to read the letters, man. Get in there. I can't imagine it adds much to any form of story. Ah. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Fun? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. Does anybody else hear something ticking? Give me those. Railroad contracts. Can't take Invoices, any more scars. Blah, blah, blah. You got anything? Not really. Sugar imports from the Spanish no, West Indies. Like a lot of sugar. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. I got a bomb. I think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> <laughs> what did you find? These. Bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. I robbed those a few well, times from Cabo Frico. And would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? Huh. What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. Mm. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Yeah. yeah. All right, do I want to kill them? Okay, get on the train, quick. Hold it. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. We won't do so, I swear. No. Lucky I don't fucking shoot your ass for that. Motherfucker oh, being insubordinate. Damn. That's a lot of fucking death. Screenshots at all for a thumbnail. I'll get something now. Oh, for Lord's sake, put that book away and go hell. Oh, Mary Beth. 
So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well, then let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. On okay. me. Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. There. There. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. All right, let's see if I don't fuck this one up. This not fuck too it up far now. Stay on this trail. Oh, there's a guy. I didn't even know that there was somebody in the back. Cut left, inland. So. Yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very... Deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was. Every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. 
I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. The spider duchess talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey! Hey! Don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I gotta be able to go faster. Of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkerton's? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, well, what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? It's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but... We kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, shit. Yeah. American Jensen. There you are, brother. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Hey, hey. Javier, my man. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway.
Damn, we were fucking quick. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. You weren't wrong, Jose. This place is perfect. Are. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Yeah, kept us Dutch. Alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a long way from a dream of virgin land in the west. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money brother. here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen. I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer Robin Banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than Damn. you do it properly. Disrespectful with that one. But to be fair, I have seen shit smarter than some of the people I've met. Chapter 2, Horseshoe Overlook. I'll, I'll go into a few missions into Chapter 2. I'm really enjoying this. Enjoy streaming it. I'm having fun. I'll go for about another hour or so. into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all I feel a little happier. Now the rain is gone. That whole mess. All right, first I off, I want to shake. Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. 
I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> Alright, I wanna show you first. I... I'm never... I'm not really much of a fan of... Uh, what you call it? Big bushy beards. Like, I don't think there's nothing wrong with it, but my personal... Oh, I don't change that here, do I? I don't think I'm gonna rock the summer gunslinger. Wait. Owned outfits, custom outfits, outfits on horses. Alright, but now, where do I shave? Where is it in there, too? Sit. Okay, never mind. I don't shave there. Then I got. I'm just gonna see my shaving. Oh, what the locker? Let's see. Okay, I wanna equip the back. Hmm. Where do I shave at then? Oh, there's more over here. Okay. Satchel, talismans. Nah. I don't think it actually had much effect. Gloves. Yeah, fuck it. I'll put gloves on. That's not uh, I guess maybe I'm just missing it. Alright then, um... Okay, I'm stuck, okay. Let's see. You- oh, shave! There you go! I don't know why I would assume that. I can, well, guess I'm gonna deal with it. I can't. No, nah, I don't look that bad actually. Not with the hat on. Oh, the map. I could access through the menu. Okay, let's see. Uncle, let's see what Uncle got for us. Don't tell me I just exited the game. No, okay. What the fuck am I staring at? Just look forward. Ow! Oh, oh, oh! Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. <laughs> So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything else. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses already. <sighs> I wish one day to be like in Bill, town. Uncle. You take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. 
<laughs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. and you're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment to civilization. <laughs> ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Yep. Move it, motherfuckers! Ladies, sing us a song. back from over there, could you? Sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one over there. You can do it, Arthur. Hey, easy now. Whoa. Easy there. Whoa now. That's easy. it, Arthur. Say, I'm the horse whisperer. I have to be the horse whisperer with this fucking massive horse. Nah, I'm I'm a I'm a stop. I'm not gonna say that. But yeah, I know what I'm talking about. There you go, Mister. Here, here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. Come on, let's go! To Valentine! <laughs> <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you have it, your pulse of old lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> I still might turn around and rob him. Smell those sheep. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Go left here, down the main street. Sheriff's always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. Yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably nope. not. Let's yep. Park up down the end there. Near the I agree. I probably will not keep a low profile. All right. Here we are, just like I said. 
Cultural oh, hi, center puppy. of civilization. <laughs> Man, it is fun. Oh, puppy, I want to. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self respecting maniac does put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right. Come on, man. Get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. Paris. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Shut up. <laughs> it's the place. Come on. Ringworm. Rats with the plague. I love you. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Oh, Alright, let's see what they got in here. Eight. Provisions, oh, tonics, there, ammunition, right? hunting and fishing, horse care, and clothing. While we're here. Plenty out on the shelves, but I got more out back. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Okay, canned apricots. Next page. You not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, oh. I don't know. Maybe. Mm. What am I supposed to get? Coffee, I think, or some shit? Drugs? Oh, hell yeah. Healthcare cocaine gum. So, mm. you're actually buying for once? Cartridges, arrows. See this? Young folk got no me. respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? The lamb or the sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. I don't know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. Okay, if you're done, I'll meet you outside. I won't be too long. Well, I, I, I think I like that mustache on him. Here's to your good health, my sir. <laughs> it's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. I didn't skip that. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house, acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? Seemed easy. They haven't gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, man. <laughs> there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. <laughs> you thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly? Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me! Get off of me! Get your hands off of her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey. Hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You're yeah. making a big mistake, Tilly Jones. Look at don't fucking blow your brains all over these walls right now, motherfucker. I ain't doing this with you right now. Go away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. 
Can I help you, sir? No trouble now, please. Oh, get the hell out of here, will you? Sorry. Wrong room. Oh, it's this room. Okay. You like that? Knock, knock, hey, motherfucker. A friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I paid. They paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here. Oh. Ah. Wasting my time. What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him. Not very well. You okay? Fine. 79 cents, you, sure? you broke motherfucker. Yeah. Nothing, nothing to worry about, just me and, but. Damn. Stupid bastard, stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. Oh, I will. Uh, everything's okay up there? After yeah. you. Ain't nothing wrong. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey, there's that guy over there looking at us. Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go uh, have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Come on, please. Hey, that's my home. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that guy got fucked up. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. Why are you telling lies about me? No, no, I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now... Ah! Ah! <sighs> I ain't done nothing wrong there. Guy wanted to lie. I don't appreciate. friend oh, what the hell did I ever do to you god damn it I just want to go home what is your problem I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just a tough as teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. And that's so worth her. Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. 
Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. There he is. Watch where you're going. Take it easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, oh, and we have our Oh, God damn it. <laughs> oh, Oh, okay. Oh, you know what? You want to knock my fucking hat off? Blocking. Sir, you won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir. But please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> I thought you'd gone to New York. <laughs> and miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. <laughs> gentlemen, always... A pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah! <laughs> Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about I me? Gotcha. Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. Damn. 
I guess I can't clean up my clothes either. Damn, that's a lot of bodies left. Alright, so let's see. Map. Alright, so we've got no more missions. Hosea, Kieran, Leopold Strauss, or Reverend Swanson. Ah, uh, mm. guess I'm gonna do Hosea's. Oh wait, whoop. Now you know what I ain't I'm being a person to turn down checking out a gun store. Gunsmith. Oh wait. Let's... You're that fellow who had to fight with Tommy outside of Smithfields? <sighs> yep. People are still talking about that fight. I ain't. Well, fair enough. Neither's Tommy. Anyway, how can I help you today? Volcanic pistol. That's cool. Pistols are... Wow, I didn't know we go to some of these. These pistols. Got a carbine. Okay, looks like it's locked. Fermin Rifle Springfield. Bolt action, no. Sawed off shotgun, pump, double barrel, pump action. Now that pump action would be a bad thing to buy. Ooh, I like that repeat, I like the repeating shotgun. Permanently increased capacity for repeater, rifle, and shotgun ammo. Okay. Permanently slowed de degradation for all weapons by 10%. Okay. Per permanently increases capacity of revolver, resolver, revolver, and pistol ammo. And then that, that's it. Alright. That's it. I'll be back. Let me see what's available. Let's see what the jag off hey, wants. Buddy. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? Sure. I'm so happy. I ain't had a friend in a long time. Long, long time. My last friend died. Weren't my fault. They said it was, but they was wrong. It's fun being with you, mister. Can I hold you a second, mister? Can I? Santa tells me he's gonna rob me, but fuck it. Okay, just quickly. That felt good. It's nice to be held sometimes. Well, we used to hold each other in the war. Ah, oh, fuck, he's gonna follow me? Run faster than him! I have regrets! Don't look at me like that, I'll fucking turn around and blow your brains out. Hey, I think I outran him. Player, let's see. Arthur. General, weight perfect, temperature fair, honor, eh, health. Let's check out the horse. Alright, 
that's fair. That queasy feeling you've been having? Think that's cause there's so many O'Driscolls about. Hey. Well, someone got my attention. You think you're the tough one out here? Think again. Law never seemed to fight. God damn! Hey, let me see that ugly mug. Come on, you stop that. You want more? I need a lawman over here. I don't want nothing to do with any of this. Forgive me. Oh shit! Hey, this is a big mistake. Help, please. Hey, hey, let, let's take it easy, friend. Show ass back here, boy. Okay, I gotta go. That fucking catching me. <laughs> Run! Run! Get out of here, Arthur. No, oh, the cops. The cops are coming. My hat. Come on, man. Why my horse gotta be so goddamn far? <sighs> God, I thought I grabbed my rifle. Pick up some something for the camp. Ah, now he had to make me feel bad by saying poor chipmunk skin. Or it might be because I, you know, uh, did I fucking rip his skin off with my bare hand? I drop the meat off too. One thing, but would you at least try to make an effort with the boy? Um, I drop him off. But father and ain't nothing I know. Here's a hint. 
Act like that you ain't a selfish like to see. What even are the Philippines? Just the biggest load of nonsense yet. You know, these hides and furs can also be done up into coats and boots and such. Beyond my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these parts, Canadian feller, Skill Tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Eh, yeah, fuck okay. it, I don't need I'll some of these shits right now. For him. Just in time, Mr. Morgan. Not the best quality, but some seasoning will hide it. Good job, Mr. Morgan. All right. Ah, Mr. Morgan. I want to make sure I grab my rifle this time. Yeah, yeah, give me a minute. I thought I grabbed my rifle. Wait, I could have sworn I grabbed it. Yeah, no, I definitely grabbed my rifle. When I was at my tent. I just thought I set it to my back. Okay, I guess not. I'm gonna keep that on my horse. What you need, Hosea? Hosea? You wanna go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My god. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. <laughs> Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him. Let's get going. Okay. But I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the yeah! The I'm one of them rich motherfuckers that got well, two horses. You're right. This is gonna be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Easy, big feller. Alright, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. Hey, that's not my fault. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy, threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there, came back in the next day, and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spark, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well... Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. 
Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You find a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. Easy, boy. <laughs> yeah, that's it, boy. Yeah. Stables are just up ahead. Come on, ladies. This sirloin will put a smile on your man. All right. Go sell that big brute. And buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Meet you back here in a bit. Hey. hey was that horse shitting? You? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <whistles> yeah. And yeah, what about this one here? Yeah, you looking to sell? I sure you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. I was going to make me choose between... I think I'm going to sell it. I think I'm going to go with this one because I know it's a little expensive, but it is the better one of the horses. Um, I shall name it. All right, let's see. I like that one. Never mind, I gotta pay for it. Mm. Ah, all right, this order should be fine. All right, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's going to look after you just fine. Hey, let's see something. Not bad, Arthur. You happy? Well, I guess we'll see. Whoa! Where's my hat? Said so I don't should be able to grab my hat from here. Hey. You won't know till you get in the saddle. Yeah. All right, let's see how this horse does. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. 
But this time, we're doing the chasing. Easy. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's Cole. He knows that. Yeah, Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place. Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. I should really be heading back over to Great Plains to see about Sean. It's bounty hunters who've got him? So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. Try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. All right. Well, lucky for you. Hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. In a blue. I. A shotgun, if I remember right. Got it. Reckon we should camp here. Sure. Alan, well, you get a set up. All right. Well, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. <sighs> Some of this? No, I'm fine. 
I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. <sighs> all right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. All right, let's sleep the full, be full seven hours. Drama. How are we going to carry a thousand pound bear back? I know horses are strong, but I don't think they're that strong. I guess maybe, I guess they are. We did use them for a while. Yeah, we do use horsepower in the car. You ready? Oh, well, give me a minute. Right. Coffee? Sure. There you go. <sighs> so. Oh. Uh, well, we'll see right, if we can see. track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And... If he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. Sorry about Tie that, it up everybody. In that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains. I don't eat predator. weaned on bear meat. Okay. I think, I think they use this one to catch a predator. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Grab your stuff. Let's go. Okay. All right. Let's go. So, like, I just want to fucking get as many shots oh, in on his face know. as I possibly can. We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the lot? No, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work... I and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's slip by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Look for tracks. Dung, bones, any sign of him. Well, oh, there's some paw marks here, Jose. They sure look big enough. This way. I am grabbing my rifle. You got me a fucked up. Rex, go into those trees. And just to have the extra bit of weaponry. Oh, oh I lost that shit instantly. Eaten fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. So 
Something else on the ground, just here. There she is. Here. Watch your step. You are stepping right in it. Reckon he's got to be close. Let's keep going. Like the trail ends here. We lost him? For now. A, a little optimism, Arthur. <sighs> well, <laughs> what do you think? I think we split up and each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which you think? Use bait? Why the fuck would we split up That's if we're bait. hunting a bear? Fine by me. That's like some Scooby Doo let's shit. Leave yeah, the bag let's over split there. up. Dies. By those books. Fucking stupid ass. Footers up ahead looks like a good spot for it. I didn't know that would fail the mission. I, I thought I could hold out my hand and then throw it, but no, I guess not. By those boulders up ahead looks like a good spot for it. More or less. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. <laughs> so do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Come on. Yeah, I'm here, man. I'm watching. Goes, eh? I know, but we need to do this right. Yeah, here. Let me guess. Got your knife? Wow, that is a bear. That's too close. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. Nothing. Ugh. Nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> he said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this bear in this stream. I'm finishing gonna it. gonna track that monster. Well... I'm gonna stick around here for a while. <laughs> uh, I'll see you back at camp. Yeah! My goal is now Hunter the Bear. Alright. Let's see what we got. Don't seem close. I want to make sure I keep my horse close. Getting close.
fucking mistake in this, this fucking bear. It was easy, man. I ain't got to worry. Wow. Holy fuck. A lot of pelt. <laughs> A lot. Here. Open my satchel. That's how. Am I not able to get more meat from this? I guess I do have to clear out some room, but... Oh, I guess I am carrying as much as I can. But can I... Put some in? Alright, uh, that's fine. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I got some food. I got some meat. I got the pelt. I don't know if I'm able to hunt it again. Alright, I'll I'll get back to camp. I'll see what I can do with this pelt and then I'll end stream. I think it's a good place to end it. He told me to. He said, yes, do it. I didn't do nothing wrong. I put this poor soul out of his misery. 
I probably could have saved him. Oh well. Come on, girl. That was just a waste yeah. of arrows, honestly. Stop moving! Onward, steed. Alright, well, nothing but a nice old horse ride. I didn't expect that to happen. <laughs> hey, well. Run, horse! Get out of here! <laughs> Nothing? God damn it, get on. Get away, horses. They can't come after me for that one. Yeah. Twenty bucks, Jesus. Come on. 
on a horse. Run! Fuck, right. How did I fail that? Is it because I let enemies to the camp? Either that or because I killed someone. Or because I killed my horse. But either way, man. <laughs> I didn't think that was going to happen. <sighs> what the fuck? No! No, I want my bear pelt! Are you serious? Ah, damn it, man. Well, alright there. I think... That's as good of a point as ever to uh, leave it there. How do I save? Do I go through here? Oh, no. Story. All right, well, I'm going to call it there. Hope you guys had a great, uh, great, um, what you call it? Good day. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I hope you're enjoying Red Dead Redemption. I am. I will be keeping this up. I think I might. I'm gonna do a good chunk of side quests. I don't know. I normally don't. But I think I'm gonna do it for this game because I think the side quests are just as entertaining as the normal quests. So I think I'm gonna continue. But I, I'm gonna finish the story. I'll do obviously the side quest along the way. But I'm really enjoying this. I hope you guys are too. This is going up on YouTube. I'll probably have it up within two, three hours. Just the HD version. Just gotta process. But other than that, I hope you guys are having a good day. Good night. See you guys later.